Hi, this is a demonstration of IoT Liquid Level Monitoring Project. So, this is an advanced system based on IoT, that is Internet of Things, that allows the user or authority to view the level of liquid in uh, tanks over the internet so the user can remotely monitor the amount of liquid that is filled in a particular tank and this is a quite flexible system where uh, the sensor or the system does not need to be fed each time with uh, the depth of the container it is placed on it does it uh, by itself so whenever you place uh, the sensor on a particular system on starting it monitors the total depth of that particular container and after that uh, is done the liquid can start filling in and uh, at that time the system measures the amount of liquid by comparing it to the total depth and this is how the system automatically monitors the amount of liquid in each container so this can be any kind of container for any kind of liquid it may be a chemical it may be water it may be milk anything the system uh, measures the value and provides it to the user so for this purpose we are using ultrasonic sensors here and uh, the sensors are interfaced with an AVR family microcontroller which is interfaced uh, in, in to a LCD display for displaying the status on the circuit itself as well as uh, it is also interfaced to a Wi-Fi modem for sending the output to a web based application as you can see on this computer screen here and this entire system is powered by a 12 volt transformer here so let's see how the system works so now let's turn on the system to see how it works so the system has been turned on now and it will now monitor the total depth of all the containers so when you start the system the the containers must be kept empty so that uh, it can measure the total depth of each one so as you can see it is measuring the total depth of each of the containers Now after this it has started monitoring, since all the containers are empty, it's showing zero. So let's do one thing, let's turn some uh, water in a container. Now as you can see the value has been updated there and also here on the web application you can see it's showing that container 1 has been filled on a level 4. So similarly let's do one thing let's add some water in another container. Now we have to wait for some time for it to scan all the containers again. So now as you can see on the next scan it monitor level 6 on container 4. Now even the web application you can see it has been updated. So let's do one thing let's try one more container. Let's fill up one more container with water.
So this is how the system works. Thank you.